Die Bettlerlumpen sind angezogen und es geht zum Bahnhof. Denn ich soll mit dem Schmuggler reden. Ähm, ich habe auch noch diese ganze Geschichte mit dem Andrew, was es äh, mit dem auf sich hat. Da geht es um den Meister Connor. Der hier irgendeinen mysteriösen Informanten äh, getroffen hat. Beziehungsweise wir haben ihn ja dahin geschickt. Hey, I was told you could help me. Is that so? Perhaps. I heard you were the discreet type. You could maybe help me and my friends get out of fear. Leave abundance. Is that true? What's your deal? Political problems? Avoiding the front? Never mind, keep your silence. Better for all. Yeah, I have some contacts that might be able to help you out. But I don't do favors. It's gonna cost you. And to be straight, to get three people out, it's gonna cost some bribes to guards and officials. Not gonna be cheap. But if you've got the serum, we can get you on your way. Brought you everything I could scrape together. Here. Good to hear. Good. Good. I'll take care of the rest. You got a map? Look here. Meet me in the underworks. It's hidden, and it'll make it easier to sneak out. Okay, mit dem geht's auch nochmal in den Untergrund. Das machen wir nicht, nicht gleich. Ich will jetzt erstmal rausbekommen, was es mit dem Andrew auf sich hat, bevor ich hier das Gebiet wieder verlasse. Gehen wir mal mit den Chefs. The Chefs. Das ist echt, also die Übersetzungen in den, in den Untertiteln sind teilweise so lose. Lieutenant Zachariah Manser. What a pleasure. Um, hello, Sir. I don't think I've had the honor of meeting you before. Ah, of course. I am Colonel Victor Watcher of the ASC. Colonel. At ease, Lieutenant, at ease. Simply came to congratulate you and learned that you become a technomancer of the highest degree. For a young man from the Rogue family, that's a terrific achievement. Thank you. No, no, thank you. Your road must have been difficult, but you persevered. An outsider who managed to work his way into the ranks of the elite technomancers. A marvelous story. Especially given their secrecy. They've always fascinated me. Do you have any insight as to why they chose to be so insular? I'm sorry, Colonel, but I don't know what you mean. What a shame. By coming to you out of friendship and camaraderie, I was hoping that you wouldn't treat me like an outsider, too. All right, then. Back to your duties. But think about what I asked, and we'll see each other again. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Das wird noch sehr angenehm werden mit dem Typen. Den Ärger kann man ja regelrecht riechen. Zagaria, a pleasure as always. Does the name Andrew mean anything to you? One might as well inquire if my own name bears meaning for me. How could it not? For with that name is resurrected horrible memories of a horrible scar that cuts across the school's otherwise illustrious history. Scars that share a similar depth and origin as that which cuts across your face. Have you forgotten? He enrolled at the same time as you, found his roots in outsiders just like you. But his family were traitors. From the beginning of his apprenticeship, we found ourselves at a loss. How much of his excess fluid should be drained? Needless to say, we misjudged. His potential to be the greatest among us was forever lost and turned against us in a torrent of chaos as students like yourself fell under the debris. Then what happened to him? He lost an arm in the accident. And did not survive. Aha. Uh -huh. Glaube nicht, dass das so stimmt. Ach, das war's schon. Schon mit dem Richtigen gesprochen. <lacht> Einfach kann's gehen. So, was können wir denn alles machen? Hier unten ist der Schmuggler. Ich sagen, Chefin, sprechen wir mal kurz hier mit der Chefin. 
Hm. Hier ist da gar nicht. Na, ja, dann taucht er bestimmt später nochmal auf. Die Mission dann jetzt richtig abgeschlossen. Scheint raus zu sein. Seems to be the case. So, ich hoffe mal, dass das jetzt langsam hier alles war. Aber so langsam können auch fast nicht mehr mehr, äh, mehr Quests auftauchen, weil jetzt haben wir eigentlich mit allen schon irgendwie ein bisschen gesprochen. Wird ja wohl nicht einfallen. Na, viel von ihr könnten doch noch mal was kommen. Lass mal gucken, ob sie uns was sagt. Na, hat sie was für uns? Ah ja. Captain, can I get some intel on a couple citizens? As long as it's mission related, Lieutenant. Her name is Abby Goodsman. Give me a sec. She's a trader with a small shop in the exchange quarter. No arrests, no complaints, no bookmark by the ASC. You said this was mission related, Lieutenant? Of course, Captain. Just following up on some leads. What do you know about a soldier named Sam Ward? Not a lot. The little I know is nothing good. Mostly about the company he keeps, like Vori. Not enough to arrest him, but enough to be glad he's not one of my problems. Word to the wise, which I hope you are. Stay away from him unless you're looking for the kind of trouble you can't dig your way out of. Of course, Captain. Captain, report. Go ahead, Lieutenant. The insurgency's been quelled. What about this pain in my ass, Bulgakov? Hey, das habe ich doch ihr schon gesagt. Good news, we found Bulgakov. It's not ideal since the go find Quartermaster Ryan for your pay. Ja, das haben wir doch schon gemacht. Okay, wahrscheinlich waren die waren die Quests teilweise ein bisschen kaputt. Mal gemacht hat, aber die das haben wir noch nicht gemacht. Die officials reached the source. Good work, Lieutenant. All safe and sound at the camp as promised, Captain. You're already making yourself one hell of an asset, Lieutenant. No doubt those officials owe you their lives. You sure as hell earned your pay. Go see the quartermaster to get it. Our response to the attack can't be passive. We strike fast, we strike hard, and we strike now. ASC discovered that they got in through the underworks, through tunnels connected to their shadow paths. So that's where we're gonna hit them. Get a rover and Amelia Reacher to drive you there. And wipe the Aurora shits off the face of Mars and destroy their damn tunnels. Failure's not an option. This is a mission of pride for this army, not just for abundance. They struck us in our home. For that, we'll annihilate them. Don't let us down, Lieutenant. During their assassination plot, Aurora's diversion attempts destroyed some of our city's roofs, forcing us to evacuate blocks of citizens to protect them from the sun. We need the repairs done and done quickly. But instead of working on the repairs where they're damn well needed, the fucking mutants have now chosen to revolt. Put an end to it, Lieutenant. Get them back to work so our city can get back to living. Will do, Captain. Before you go, Lieutenant, I want you to know, your professor, Captain Sean Manser, is leaving the city for the front. I want to go say goodbye. Thank you, Captain. Appreciate it. Oh, jetzt geht's aber hier richtig los. Where the hell's this shadow path and how they managed to build tunnels into Ophir? It's out by positions we lost to Aurora months ago. We may have occupied the area, but we had no idea about the tunnels. Maybe they were built by Aurora after they took control. Or maybe they were already there and the shits just stumbled across them by accident. Quite frankly, I don't give a damn why. We just need a solution, and it'd be a hell of a lot easier to close it off at the source than trying to find our way through the Underworks Labyrinth. Es ist eigentlich ganz witzig, dass diese Wege Shadow Path heißen, weil es ja auch echt wichtig ist, dass die Leute da nicht in der Sonne unterwegs sind. So what are we up against? Not in detail, but I'm sure it's nothing you can't handle, Lieutenant. Soldiers and the like, including your Aurora counterparts, Technomancers. I hope that won't be an issue for you. 
I know you all see each other as brothers and sisters, but they're not, Lieutenant. They're your enemies, and I trust that you'll have no problem treating them like that. Ja, das ist halt ein bisschen schwierig. Who's Amelia Reacher? You really don't know her. She's an icon of abundance. It's poster child, youthful and courageous, the daughter of one of abundance's great discoverers, and one of the few people who can fix and drive the rovers. Hm. Da ist unser Weg aus der Stadt. I assume you got more intel on the attack. What happened? Apparently some double agents from Aurora were hiding out in the slums until they launched the orchestrated attack. One group created a diversion while the others tried to assassinate some of our civil servants. They might be enemies, but they're not idiots. Their diversion was thought out, made a hell of a political statement. They knew that destroying the Rue shutters would incite panic in the lower regions of the city. Needless to say, it's also humiliating that they could pull it off. Damn lucky most of the damage was contained and the bulk of the city is just fine. What do we know about the mutants who revolted? Just simple creatures that got too frustrated. They know a lot of them will die during the repairs we're trying to force them to make. Like animals, they need to be trained. Broken in. But like any animal, there's a line where us using them in a certain way becomes cruelty. So they revolted. Because their supervisors abused their power. I want you to go see how they're being treated. We keep them well fed and well equipped. We can keep them well behaved. Those things don't go out looking for fights if we don't make them. Das ist auch so ein, so ein Menschen-Mutanten-Freund. How's the mutant pan organized? It's just like a work camp in the city. The creatures have places to eat and sleep and otherwise they're put to work on projects in the area. Sometimes they're even brought out to do work elsewhere in the city. They're always returned at night. It's not a bad setup, but unfortunately, the city's expanded and now there's houses built right up against the pen. With the idea of a revolt, it becomes a powder keg situation. Those creatures could do some real damage. We should have moved them further from the population when we had the chance. Maybe near the roof would have been fewer risks. So, gibt's hier noch was Neues? Uh, Aurora? Neu, oder? And tell me what you know about the enemies of Aurora. What is there to say about Aurora? Their profound youth, rivaled only by the enormity of their ambition, threatening to take all that we've built. A cult with their technomancers guiding their minds and souls with as much ease as they guide their weaponry. How they trained and equipped so many eludes us, and therein lies their advantage. That and their willingness to send civilians, even children, to die in war. Very close. How is Aurora governed? The Dows are at the helm. Sands a council of the people around him. Their former Dowser died of old age, replaced by the well-admired General Wisdom. Ridiculous people with ridiculous names, if you ask me. But that's as deep as my knowledge goes on the subject. And how goes the war, Captain? We're mired by setbacks. But it's nothing we can't recover from. We're better trained, better armed, and now with our elite units, are more capable of combating their technomancers. Victory will be ours in time. Our experience and stability will win out over their youth and religious fanaticism soon enough. Yeah, genau. Genau so wird's kommen. Der Stand ist auch neu, oder? Ne, das dürfte alt sein. Irgendwas bei den Orten? Ne, das ist auch alles alt. Gut. Wir hier auch informiert. Es kommen echt, es ist, also wird nicht weniger. Krass. Das ist der Soldat, der hier die blackmailen will, die Dame. Hauptmission. Bild von Sean. Und hier ist noch die Finde Schmuggler im Untergrund Mission. Moment, bevor wir jetzt hier in den Kampf geraten, <lacht> ziehen wir uns mal wieder was Vernünftiges an. Das kann ruhig wahr sein. Zack. Er hier ne, boah, leichte äh, ja warte mal warum habe ich denn 
Ach nee, das ist der Arzt, der sieht nur so komisch aus. Okay, der stand da gerade so merkwürdig. Er kriegt, äh, was kriegt er denn? Bettenjacke? Nee. Der kriegt hier so eine Jacke und der Arzt kriegt aber, er hier kriegt einen Arztmantel. Das ist aber gar nicht so verteidigt. Moment mal. Ich denke, ich könnte dabei bleiben. Das lassen wir jetzt mal so. Außerdem sieht er ein bisschen, bisschen rockiger dann aus. <lacht> Hier noch was Cooles. Äh, Technomancer Hose kann ich noch nicht anziehen. Und in Sachen Waffen habe ich einen Totschläger. Nö, da bleibe ich bei dem Ding. Das benutze ich eh nicht. Erfahrungspunkte gab es auch noch nicht. Alles gut. Sieht mir die falschen Tastendrücke. Ah, nee, Moment. Eine Sache noch. Ich mich kurz, kurz schlafen, ähm, damit ich meinen Erfahrungspunkte-Bonus wieder bekomme. Außerdem, damit es Nacht wird, damit die, ähm, die Mutantenarbeiter zu Hause sind, weil die gehen nach Hause. Andererseits, wenn die gerade einen Aufstand haben, ist auch ein bisschen komisch, wenn die jetzt nach Hause gehen. Sie haben eine Visite zu dieser schönen Abby-Girl. Ja. Sie hat ihre Lernen gelernt, nachdem wir ihre Schule verloren haben. Vielleicht können wir ihre Lernen in einem anderen Weg lernen. Hahaha, sick. Du bist sick. Aber es ist ein sick, ich würde mich nicht mehr verletzen. Ja? Warum nicht? Das ist eine schöne Mädchen. Ich werde Chris holen und wir machen eine Party. Nice, sounds good. Hey, sh 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 shut up. I hear something. All right, pretty simple. Just gotta stop the soldier so he can't make good on his threats. Whoever these soldiers are, we gotta save Ms. Goodsman before they hurt her. But that's what we're here for, Jeff. Saving ladies in distress. Hey, stop it. Soldiers, cut it out. Who the hell do you think you are? Trying to give me orders, Mancer. I don't report to you, and you don't have a damn clue what's going on here. We'll take what we're owed from the broad and leave it for dead if we want. We clear? Or did we misunderstand and you just want to join us in the beatdown? Und danke. Ah, noch einer. Mehr. Oh. <lacht> für, für everything you've done for me. I don't if there is anything, anything I can ever do for you. Please tell me. Thank you. Kein Problem. So was machen wir doch jeden Tag. Sängerin berichten wir aber erst nachher. Schauen wir erstmal. Ja, da ist der. Können wir der Sängerin berichten. Gehen wir mal ganz kurz in die Slums zurück, dass wir hier das Geschenk von dem Mutant überreichen können. Meine ich noch die ganze Geschichte mit, dass der Kollege meint, wir würden verfolgt werden? Noch nicht gestartet. Oder das passiert gar nicht in jeder Gegend. Schauen. Creatures, aren't they? 
torn from the loving bosom of their homes, their families, thrown into work camps far from love. Terrible. A terrible life. Fortunately, that one doesn't appear to be too smart. Perhaps he doesn't realize what has even occurred to him. I wonder his mother, how she must feel. Does she still love him as her child? So, wie kommt man da hin? Eigentlich müssten wir doch hier hinten auch den Aufstand, ähm, uns um den Aufstand kümmern können. Das ist doch auch Teil, das ist doch sogar Teil der Hauptmission, der Aufstand, oder? Da hinten so ein, so ein ähm, so ein großes Quest. Was der Questmark ist. Ja, das ist sogar die Hauptaufgabe. Aber. Dann ist das aber woanders. Moment. Hier. Mutter vom Bag. Und da ist die Hauptaufgabe. Dann gebe ich aber erstmal. Der Mama das Geschenk. Danach gucken wir uns hier mal diese Hauptaufgabe an mit dem, ähm, mit dem Aufstand der Mutanten. Jetzt los. Ich glaube, es hockt. das werden hier? Weg mit euch. Ach, jetzt hat uns die, die Miliz, also die, oder das Militär mehr oder weniger, hat uns sogar geholfen. Sehr interessant. Ich hätte gedacht, die würden gar nicht auf sowas reagieren. Wollen wir kurz mit Jeffrey reden? Lieutenant, uh, sorry to bug you. Genau, das hat er uns ja schon gesagt. Look, Zuhören, er glaubt, uns verfolgt jemand. Alright. Hell yeah. I, we just treat it? That's one way to go. All right. Why not? Let's try it. See what happens. Okay, das ist dann wieder in der Kaserne. Ich hatte ehrlich gesagt auch gehofft, dass sie jetzt hier sagen, wo man das macht. Weil das wäre ein bisschen doof gewesen. Wenn man das irgendwo machen würde. Eugenie Labor. That's me. What can I do for you? Nothing for me. A mutant named Beg sent me to give you something. A souvenir or... I don't know. It's just a stone that he drew on. Das ist seine Mutter, oder? Oder doch? Thank you. Oh, my dear little... Hey there! Oh. What the fuck? She simply placed the stone in her mouth, did not even swallow it, and yet it took her life. How... what would possess her to do such a thing? Apparently just the fear of getting arrested, Scott. Hä? Eh? Also die Szene habe ich jetzt überhaupt nicht verstanden. Was... Was sollte das denn jetzt bedeuten? Hier ist auch noch der Rover-Hunger. Da kommen wir dann auch nochmal weiter. Mein Gott, ganz schön viele, ganz schön viele Hauptquests. Schauen wir uns erstmal den, den ähm, Mutantenaufstand an. Aber ich glaube, das machen wir erst in der nächsten Folge. Bis dann!